you are watching Global Daily Mirror News Alerts. Three personnel from the Philippine Air Force were killed in a car accident. The vehicle crashed in concrete barriers on Edsa and Cubao before bursting into flames Friday morning. PAF confirmed that four of their personnel were involved. One of the personnel survived the accident. PAF is coordinating with authorities on the investigation. Several government-owned treatment hospitals in Quezon City received a total of 1.3 billion pesos in additional funds this year under the 2022 national budget. Anakalusugan Representative Mike Defensor said the Lung Center of the Philippines will receive an augmentation of 179 million pesos from 505 million pesos last year. The National Kidney and Transplant Institute will get 300 million more from 1.3 billion pesos, while the Philippine Heart Center will have an additional 100 million pesos from 1.8 billion pesos. The rest of the hospitals receiving additional budget are the East Avenue Medical Center, Philippine Orthopedic Center, National Children's Hospital, and Quirino Memorial Medical Center. Defensor said the extra taxpayer subsidy will allow these hospitals to provide more services and financial assistance to their patients. The northeast monsoon or hanging amihan is affecting northern Luzon. According to Pagasa, the weather system will bring party cloudy to cloudy skies with isolated rain showers over Ilocos region, Cordillera, and the rest of Cagayan Valley. Cloudy skies with rains is expected over Batanes and Babuyan Islands. The humid easterly winds is affecting the rest of the country. Localized thunderstorms may happen in the afternoon or evening. Pagasa says Caraga and Davao region will experience cloudy skies with scattered rain showers and thunderstorms, which may trigger flooding in low-lying areas and areas near waterways. For entertainment news, here's Leslie Ordinario. Is James Reed leaving the Philippines for good? On Instagram, Reed's sister on mother's side, Chantal Kalikdin, shared photos of her with their mother, Emma McDonald, hugging the actor with the airport behind them as they sent him off as he departed from the Philippines. Earlier this week, James celebrated with a despedida or a farewell party with his friends and colleagues in careless music. Meanwhile, Reed has not yet announced where he was headed or if there is a project involved. Heading international, meet Sophia Girao, Victoria's Secret's first model with Down Syndrome. The Puerto Rican model Sofia Girao just made history after becoming the first Victoria's Secret model with Down Syndrome for the Love Cloud Collection. Sophia happily shared the news on her Instagram account with her lovely photo and said it's a dream come true in the caption. And that's the latest for this hour. Subscribe to Global Daily Mirror on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Visit www.globaldailymirror.com. This has been Ice Martinez. Good afternoon.